the universe. The release of initial results coincided with Thursday's launch. It's part of the largest scientific instrument on Earth, the Square Kilometer Array Project. Ghana. A West African country with 27 million people. Strategically positioned halfway between South Africa and Europe. Just 25 kilometers northwest of the capital, Accra, a defunct communications dish turned radio telescope. Joyce Korateng Aqua is one of the scientists involved in the milestone project. Using this smaller dish, the 34-year-old explains how the five-story high dish collects data. When signals strike the reflecting surface, it goes to the receiver. This whole thing is connected to a, a computer. So these signals convert uh, from signal mode to uh, readable modes. I'm trying to find complex molecules like methanol. They, they are actually form stars. Working with the data after, after reducing it, after cleaning it, making it good. This is what I see. And it's already raking in data. Right here you have the central star that is forming. All around it is a disk, a rotating disk that helps material to fall into the central star to help it grow in its mass. South Africa, a SKA pioneer, lent a hand, providing expertise, skills and financial assistance. With the highly anticipated launch done and dusted for Ghana, these are clearly exciting and lucrative developments to be a part of and there is enough proof that Africa's race to space has just begun and there's no returning to base. From the time of the Big Bang to a constantly expanding universe, Ghana will now help unravel the mysteries. Maghikita Matabe, SABC News, Kuntunse, Ghana.